Okay, so shadows are working. <laughs> um, so you literally can hardly... Wow. So welcome back, everyone. We're doing a live dev build preview kind of thing. We're taking a look at some of the new features in the latest StarMade 0.178. Um, guys, any comments? But Need general, more colors. Needs more colors. All right, so basically what we've got then is we've got like blue, yellow, red. I've got all the colors being represented here. So right click oh, allows wow, us to man. rotate. So I'm gonna rotate it a little bit more. The main box you're looking at there is the primary star system, the one where you spawn in on. And uh, the square indicates the limits of that sector. I mean, obviously if I was to push shift and A, I'm going to jump over to the star system next to it. And as you can see here, we've got a multicolored rings. And I believe they're asteroid belts, are they? Is that asteroids? I think it's supposed to be inner planets, asteroid belt, outer planets. Well, like I say, looking at the picture, I've got a green inner, uh, oh, cool. green they're, they're middle. Look. Yeah, they're on a slant. Yeah, yeah, Beautiful. yeah. They're all on different slants. Uh, but, but like I say, what I wanted to say was diff distance from star indicates different asteroids, right? So, I mean, I don't know exactly what that is indicating, but I'm sure I'll figure it out. So if anyone is, wants to jump in. This is essentially in, solar hey? system coordinates now we're looking at, right? Not our familiar <laughs> sectors. No, no, no. no what no. you're looking at is sectors. Each of those, each of those cubes is a sector. But they've yeah. been organized into right. A but I mean, the, the numbers layout. that are around the cube are system numbers. Hmm. Yeah, zero, you have zero, system one. numbers. You, you have system numbers, and you have sector. Right. Numbers. Okay. Cool. Can I just yeah, clean yeah, that yeah. Up? So those right. big numbers are system numbers. The little cube is a sector. Okay. Can I just jump in there? All right. See the four numbers. Sure. That's the, the the four numbers which you're looking at are the number for the sector which you would go to if you went to that face. So if I go through 001's face, I'm in 001. I'm in 1110. Those one, are the zero, bordering systems. Yeah, right? that, that's just a label representing the border. You would see those normally on a sector boundary anyway. If I had tab G off and I look, it says over there sector 122. Two. So if I push P and then I have a look around, I should be able to go 112. Oh, I'm not even in my home. So sector. this is just like when you're flying around in space, you see the nearby sector there you um, go. labels. There you this go. is in the mini map, you're seeing the nearby star Systems. system labels. Yeah, it's the same concept, but on the next okay, level great. up. That's, that's what I was asking. Yeah, yeah. Fantastic. So you're right. That's beautiful. Um, yeah. So at the moment, we are at system 0. And then it zero, looks like zero, different zero, systems orient two, and two, have two, planets two. aligned on their accretion disk completely differently. So if anyone looks here, if you can see the yeah, little point there, that point is zero, zero, zero. All right. So obviously one, two, one, two, one, two. There's two, 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 which is the default spawn. Okay. So that there is where I'm currently at. This box is the starting sector with the shop in the middle and my ship next to it. Okay. So if I scroll out, let's just have a look at a couple of these here. If I go to the right, as you can see, as soon as I cross the boundary, it's giving me the next disk. If I just do tab G, you can get some of that information off the screen, clean it up a bit. So there it is. Now, let's just go back one up on here. And there we go, we've got another one, different angle, different distribution. Okay, another one, again, different angle, different distribution, slightly different position as well, I like it. It's really cool. And then I also did down here as well. I checked them out. Now there was one that was... Nope, they're all showing up now. And as you can see, so if I go from here, I've got all different star systems with their orbitals. So now we're going to do it, guys. We're going to scroll out. And this is the bit that everyone's been waiting to see. Now you can make it out best if I rotate. And as you can see, we might find it familiar to look at. That would be a spiral arm galaxy with, I think, three spiral arms. Whoa. And as you can see, one of them is a, is a lot more dense, I guess. 
Are those warp navigable warp gates that's displaying? Yeah, the the links there are. No, well, no. no, they're no. Oh no, they're not warp gates, mate. Oh no, they're even see, better. See, see how they go way further than 128 sectors? Yeah, they that's do. That's awesome. what warp say. gates can do. Yeah. Um. They. Do, do you want to hazard a guess at what those are? Yeah, go on, guys. Wormholes. Of course, they're wormholes. Lovely. So, and as far as I can understand it, are we allowed to say anything about wormholes? Probably not. I'm just going to leave it there, um, mystery meta, because I don't want to tell anyone anything about them that hasn't been allowed to, you know. I mean, it, it's kind of shown here, to be honest, but if there's something you'll notice about the route, it's predominantly doing what, anyone? What's the route doing on the arm? What's it doing? What's well, one of them is zoom following it, so I assume it's it, the, when a wormhole is is if we have a look at the arrows, randomly connects to another Zoom wormhole. in on one of the nodes. Yeah, if you have a look at one of the arrows here, you can see the arrows with the direction of travel. And if there's something here, you'll notice. <laughs> yeah. They snake all the way back to the center. I don't know if you can see the basically what happens is arrows. you can use them to travel to the outside of the galaxy but um you're not going to get trapped out there no you can circle back into the middle from the exteriors which also means when you travel to a new star system if you find the local wormhole you can travel to the center of that or uh, to the center of the galaxy when you go to new galaxy not not star system sorry see i would like to know what these big stars are though because there's a few stars that are really big i don't know if you've noticed that but fly one i think i'm gonna have to all right so let's just come to here right Wait, i think we might have to do one? a uh we, we might have to do a new command change system instead of change sector right <laughs> Right, so that's me. So if I want to go to this one, yeah, this, whoa, 